Hi boys and girls, today we are going to look at a few different shapes and then I have a fun activity planned for after. So let's get started. Shapes. Circles are so round and jolly. Just take a look at the colorful lolly. What are some things that are circles? Donuts, a ball, lollipops, marbles, a tire or a wheel, a yo-yo, buttons, a clock, bubbles, oranges, and a globe. The four sides of a square are all the same. Just look at the blocks and the board game. What are some other things that are square? A grocery bag, dice, gifts, a face cloth, a tissue box, a picture frame, blocks, a chessboard, and sometimes a calendar. Did you know triangles are made up of threes, three sides, and three points? Just look at the cheese. What else is a triangle? A ruler could be a triangle. A sandwich could be cut into a triangle. There's an instrument named a triangle. Pine trees, cheese, party hats, watermelon, pizza, a sailboat, and a teepee. How many sides does a triangle have? One, two, three. A rectangle is a square that has been stretched. Just look at the pictures. It's not so far fetched. Some things that are rectangles, letters or envelopes, a carpet could be a rectangle, a flag, a piano, a ruler, a juice box, a photo album, a birthday card, a book, and a door is a rectangle. Put two triangles together and we bet a glittering diamond is what you will get. We have some pretty diamond shaped gems, a top, tiles, earrings, a warning sign, a palette knife, a tie, a baseball field, which is actually called a baseball diamond, a kite. Those are some pretty cool shapes. So I have a very fun activity for us. All you're going to need is some tape. So go get some tape and come meet me right back here. Hi boys and girls, welcome back. So as you can see, I used my blue tape to make two shapes on the floor. What shapes did I make? I made a rectangle and I made a circle. So what I did was I walked around my house and tried to find things that were these shapes. So now I'm going to sort them. Let's see what I found. I found a donut, a potato, a cell phone, a book, a cap, and some stamps. Hmm, I wonder where these go. Let's start with the book. Is this book a circle or is this book a rectangle. Hmm, let's see. I don't think it's round because I see it has one, two, three, four different sides. Let's see, does a rectangle have four different sides? One, two, three, four. Does a circle have four different sides? Hmm, a circle doesn't have any sides. I think this one is a Rectangle, let's try the potato. 
Does my potato have any sides or any points? No. So that means it can't be a rectangle. It must be a circle. What about this cap? Hmm. I don't see any points, so it can't be a rectangle. That must mean it's a circle. Good job. Ooh, what about this? Hmm. I think it has some points. Let's count. One, two, three, four. That must mean it's a rectangle. And what about my cell phone case? Let's see. One, two, three, four. That's a rectangle. Last but not least, my donut. Hmm, what could this be? I don't see any points on this one. So that means it can't be a rectangle. It must be a circle. Awesome job, boys and girls. Thank you so much for helping me sort my shapes, but now it's your turn. I want you to go through the house and see if you can find any circles, squares, triangles, rectangles, or diamonds. And you can do exactly what we just did. Make some shapes on the floor and sort them in the right spot. And let me know how it goes. I'll talk to you later. Goodbye.